Hey, what's up YouTube and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I wanted to talk to you guys and also share my experience with the first time of me getting a Brazilian wax. Oh my goodness, it was very interesting. So yeah, I'm a, um, I have a little bit of footage. I couldn't record too much, but I have a little bit of footage that, that I can actually show you guys and then I will come back and talk to you guys about, you know, what to expect, how is it like, and things that I didn't know going into it. So hopefully it will help you guys if you're considering getting a wax for the first time. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. Okay, so this is the real tea on waxes. This is like the real, real. So first things first, I got inside and I was just waiting to see somebody. Um, this location probably had about four to five people working. So, and I just did a walk-in. So I walked in, asked me what type of services I wanted because they have like all these different types of services. They have eyebrow threading, eyebrow tinting, they had, um, I wanna say some facials, they had the waxing service, full body or Brazilian, but they have a whole list of services and I just came there to get a Brazilian wax. Filled out the paperwork and I was sitting around waiting for a little bit. Um, I didn't have to wait too long. I probably sat down for like 10 minutes before she was ready for me. So, um, yeah, so I walked back to the back of the shop or location or whatever you want to call it. So I walked straight back to the back and it was a room. It had like some um, pots. I don't know what to call it, but it looked like crock pots or whatever of wax, different waxes. And then it was like a table for me to lay down on. And she told me to put my head on this side and the rest of my body will lay this way. So so then she left shut the door so then i got nervous i'm like oh my gosh is this really happening like is this really really happening like This whole time, this whole time I'm, come to, I'm contemplating walking out. Like, should I go through it? Should I walk out? Like, when I walked in, I was like, should I walk out? When I got to that back room, I was like, should I walk out? Like, but my body was still going through the motion. So I'm over here getting undressed. I'm taking off my clothes. I didn't wear any underwear just because my friend told me not to. Um, she told me to wear something kind of loose and comfortable to wear. So I just wore sweatpants. She, I'm trying to remember. She came back to the back. Um, she did ask me if this was my first time getting waxed. I told her yes, and I was scared as fuck. Um, and we both kind of like shared a quick laugh. Uh, so she told me about these different types of waxes. And one was like a charcoal wax, which is good if your hair is kind of like coarse and thick and like curly. Um, and then there was like a tea tree wax. Their wax for like ingrown hairs. Another wax for like discoloration and all that stuff. So I just chose the charcoal wax because I know, huh? So, um, so yeah, she showed me all these different types of waxes and I just chose the charcoal mask. I mean, not charcoal mask, but I chose the charcoal wax because I just knew what was going on down there and it was just not pretty. It was not cute at all. It was very, very disturbing actually. Um, she said, she said she'll do it in kind of like smaller sections. She told me to like hold my stomach. So let's say this is my hoo-ha area and this is my stomach, like right above it. She told me to like press and pull like this so that the skin would stretch a little bit so it wouldn't hurt as bad. my gosh you guys I thought I was gonna be able to record this but I just knew my nerves started kicking and I was like whoo, 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 whoo. I got really nervous so 
I picked out the wax. She told me what I should do. Um, first thing she did was she just lathered me up in, I don't know if it was oil or what, but she just rubbed something all over me. And then after she did that, she put like some type of powder, like baby powder, I don't know. She put powder over it. She told me, um, she put the, the powder was for the sweat. So since this is my first time, I was like really nervous. I was kind of sweating. It's not the best thing in the world if you sweat. It makes it a little bit more difficult for the wax to like grip if you're sweating. So she had to like put extra baby powder on me because I was like, <sighs> not only that, but there was a fan also blowing upward so that it would keep me kind of calm and cool, but it was just not working. So this is my friend, hold on, focus, focus. My friend is trying to hype me up. After I got prepped and ready, like kind of like the sides, she put the wax down, um, she started smoothing it out. This wax dries pretty quick, so as she put it on my skin and, and used the um, popsicle stick to kind of like even and smooth it out a little bit, it, it started pulling a little bit, like you could feel the nudge. It wasn't like nothing too crazy, but I just knew that that small little nudge was gonna really like, affect me um she so she started smoothing it out a little bit and then she just let it she started letting it dry and in my head i'm thinking um you don't want this to dry down too quick you know you gotta get that paper and like you know i'm thinking it's like no it was not that situation at all so she put some on one side of my leg put some on the other side of my leg and let it cool down and let it get hard and after about a few minutes or so when I tell you guys, she started like inching it off, like, <clears throat> like I'm gonna have to insert a video of what I mean, but she kind of like started like ripping it off. It wasn't like a cool, like all in one rip off. It was like, <laughs> it was like tugging at my skin. Like this thing was like, I'm gonna insert a video, but that was the most painful thing oh my gosh I couldn't even let her finish like we got halfway through the first strip halfway through didn't even like take the whole first strip off we got halfway through and I was like <sighs> I was like what's going on what are you doing like I couldn't even hold my stomach I was like holding the bed I had I had my hat on I'm holding my hat like oh my goodness oh my goodness like going crazy I was yelling um, not really yelling, but I was like, oh my gosh, like, I was saying, oh my gosh, oh shoot, like, oops. It was not a fun time, like, it was not fun at all. I was like, oh, this hurts. Like, first of all, let me just give you guys a quick rundown. Me, so I hated getting my eyebrows waxed because that hurt. I hated getting my hair done when I was younger because I'm very tender-headed. And yeah, like right before I got my Brazilian wax, I got my chin wax because y'all, me and hair, I don't even know. I don't know what to say, I don't know what's going on, but it's a love-hate relationship. It was my first time getting a wax, I will say it was very, very painful. Um, so some quick um, things I will mention for myself. I haven't shaved in about a week, a week and a half, my I grow a lot of hair. Um, I grow a lot of hair and my hair is really thick, so I shave about every other day, just depending. I really don't shave every other day, but I could because my hair grows back just that. Thing else I would say, there is a difference in waxes and different wax techniques, so make sure you like look into what type of wax you're getting. Don't just assume with the Brazilian wax, it's just gonna be like, just like your eyebrows or your or wherever you're used to getting wax. But yeah, that is pretty much that. I hope you guys enjoyed this little story time from me. If you have gotten a wax before, let me know in the comments down below how it was, what was the worst part for you. The most painful part for me would probably be the the lips, bitch. I will not lie to you. Them lips. So sensitive. Like, so sensitive. Like, when she first ripped it off, I felt my mouth just like water. Like, it's like all of my body wanted to cry. Like, I was crying. My mouth wanted to cry. It was just, it was just too much pain. The lips is definitely the worst part. 
definitely taking her advice. I'm not shaming again because I can't go through the same amount of pain again. Like I cannot, like my body just cannot. I don't even know about kids no more because I am a weak. I'm a weak female. I'm weak, I'm sensitive, I cry a lot, I'm tender headed. I don't do well with all that stuff, so. That's just that on. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna also just insert the footage of me um because i ran a few errands i went to get my nails done right before i got the wax i decided to do color a little bit of color because i'm always so plain like who am i today i'm always so plain and i figured why not do like a little bit of something i felt like these would match my instagram aesthetic for the moment so i also like i said i got my chin wax today i went to target to pick up a few goodies so i hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye